Hey guys, it's Chatty Dad One coming at you. Um, some news today. Our disgusting government is once again cutting food stamps. It's going to be cut over a 10 year time period. Now, this farm bill is a disaster. It is not a good thing at all. Um, I mean, there ain't much I can say good about it. They have been working on this bill for quite some time, years. It is stalled because they couldn't get it together. Now, one thing that I've noticed, at least 530 or 350 companies and organizations including Monsanto, PepsiCo, and Dean Foods registered as lobbyists in 2013 to work on the Senate bill. Now, anybody, especially with Monsanto, involved in this bill it's not good not good at all um, and here it says uh, US farm policies reverting to a 1949 law that would potentially double milk prices and every other dairy food you can think of I mean this is just horrid this is a horrid law. The food stamps are going to be cut 1%. And they've already been cut. They're going to continue cutting and cutting and cutting and cutting. They're going to continue to cut the food stamps right here this article here doesn't even say anything about all this stuff so I mean you know CNN thank you very much you scumbags you will know a lot more about your meat farmers will see less risk federal government takes on more now farmers are gonna see less risk and they're gonna have less control Lawmakers aren't disclosing something. Really? Is that, uh, that is not surprising. We have land problems. What goes in your body? Corn and sushi. Which crops the U.S. government wants to encourage or protect? It gives incentives to grow more of them. The most subsidized crop in this um, farm bill are so-called row crops like uh, soy and the Franken corn. Believe me with Monsanto's up in their lobbying yeah they're going to give incentives to grow more of these crops which is already making people sick and GMO all the way. Let me let you get a look at this bill. Because, um, believe me, that's a monster. Oh, these are bills that are sent to the president. Um, this is the bill. Get a look at this. It is so massive it is so huge it's got so many sections it's unbelievable it's almost like the affor affordable health care act bill I mean it's huge it's huge and any bill this huge 
is not a good thing. Payment limitations. Payments limited to active farmers. I mean, this is not good. This is just not good, people. There might be a few good things in it, but the majority of it is underhanded and puts us into a state of disaster. I'm just, I'm just personally, I'm just blown away by this. It's disgusting to me. But each one of these has a, uh, you know, has a big old long list on it too. I mean, this is just the section of it. And each one of them has a a uh, big thing like this. Agricultural Water Enhancement Program, Wildlife Habitat Incentive Program, Great Lakes Basin Program, Chesapeake Bay Watershed Program. It's not good, people. When you get into so many things like this thing is, it, it's not good. Not good at all. Hunger Games coming at ya. But yeah. Prepare for more food stamp cuts. Because they're coming. I hate to say. It's going to continue. They're going to continue to cut where they shouldn't. I hope everyone's well. I'll leave the links to these uh, articles and this bill below. I hope y'all are having a good evening. God bless. Good luck to us all. And God help us all with these leaders who are not for the people in our government. We've got to take our government back. Because they're looking to ruin us. Anybody that's in the middle class. We've got to stand up and we've got to put an end to this corruption. This is Chatty Dad 1. Never give up your guns. Your rights will go right along with them. It's all we got left. Hang on for these uh, laws. Our food is going to be at a crisis point pretty soon. Chatty Dad 1 over and out.